Need some coins for the God Squad you've always wanted? Check out rockbottomcoins.com for the safest and cheapest coins anywhere. Make sure you check out the solo grinding service as well. Use code Zerk at checkout for a 10% discount on your order. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Xerxy coming at you today with another YouTube video and today I'm going to be showing you guys my best weekend league finish ever and also before we get to this I just want to talk about the Cowboys game right now. I'm recording this video at Sunday at halftime of the Cowboys game. We are currently up 24 to nothing over the Jags. I did not see this coming. Uh, to be honest though this game would be like a 9 to 6 game with the winner being decided last second I guess. It's completely the opposite 24 to nothing cowboys are up and i probably will have a team of the week predictions video probably already up for today uh i'm gonna guess that cole beasley's in there he has two touchdowns and like 80 yards already and then maybe dak prescott will be in there as well he does have two touchdowns passing and a rushing touchdown and maybe if he gets another pass touchdown we'll talk about him as the team of the week here on my team of the week predictions video which is probably already up so make sure you guys go check that video out but Let's get into my weekend league rewards now, or not rewards, but my rank and also my lineup. Now, I did make a couple changes in my lineup, including some chemistry changes. As of right now, we are currently ranked 62 in weekend league. Now, I got 18 wins. Uh, I don't think I can actually show you guys, sadly. I started off 11 and 1. Now, if you guys watch my live streams, <laughs> oh boy, that was a it was a bad stream. If you saw the stream, I believe it was Saturday. Uh, we played two games on stream and i ended up in the stream because it was absolutely terrible started 11 and 1 and then i think i ended up going 11 and 4 uh winning a couple of games so i was i think 13 and 4 and then i think i lost the next what did i lose if i was 13 and 4 then i think that i lost the next like four or five games so that'd be 13 and 9 yeah so no no, no, okay, whatever. You get the point. We started off 11 and 1. We, we lost two games, won a couple, and then we went on like a big losing streak or we lost like three or four or five, something like that. And then we ended up winning up, uh, winning, I think, basically all the last games except for one of the last. So the second to last game I lost, and then I won my last game to get 18 wins. So I'm not really sure exactly how it all happened. Unfortunately, I can't show you guys. But in the end, we ended up with 18 wins, which I've actually never even got over... I never got 18 wins in general and of course this week they changed it now so 18 wins or actually 16 wins would be ultimate now i'm gonna have to reset my xbox real quickly to show you guys so when we come back we'll see exactly what my rank is all right so now that we refresh we are now ranked 62 which i think we were we were uh rank 62 when we refreshed as well but now i can show you guys the rest of the leaderboards i don't know if i'm gonna make top 100 hopefully i do uh 18 wins usually sneaks in there but it depends on strength of schedule so we'll find out about that but ultimate is still gonna be 16 wins and i'll show you guys the ultimate rewards and also top 100 rewards so we can see exactly what we're gonna get so right now snaponic is 23 and 0 and if we go down here my friend muttrud is 20 and 0 or 20 and 0 he went uh 20 and 5 and that meant snaponic actually had zero games left so he went 23 and 2 so he's probably gonna make like top 20 uh probably like top 10 actually but where i'm at right now i think we might just happen to make top 100 uh we have a 91.916 strength of schedule so the possibility of me staying in top 100 is not bad the only thing is that there are a lot of people right now with 18 wins now the people with 19 wins it seems like there's quite a few of them as well now of course right now it is currently 5 52 p.m eastern time so there's a lot of time still left to play. I mean, right now, I'm pretty sure 17 wins is going to be... Yeah, so 17 wins right now is top 100, but that's not going to make it to top 100. It's going to be 18 wins, obviously. Hopefully, I can sneak in there. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to, but if I do, that would be awesome because it goes to those rewards are a lot better. Now, if we take a look at the rewards, if I make top 100, of course, I'll get 130k quick sell, 14 season tokens. I would also get the weekend league mashup top 100 fantasy pack. Plus, I'll get the ultimate tier packs, which, of course, is going to be... Uh, two touchdown packs, I believe. What is it? It's two touchdowns. Three, I believe. I actually have no idea. I think I think it's two red zone, and it looks like three touchdown. That's not bad. So two red zone, three touchdown, 110k quick sell, and 11 season tokens. Now I know that if you take the packs over 
uh, or you take like the coins instead of the packs, you would end up getting about 330k, I believe. So that's pretty dang solid. Now, of course, I'm going to open the packs for you guys, but at least I get the 110,000 coin quick sell and the season tokens. Also, thank you guys very much for 42,000 subscribers. We just hit 42k. So if you guys are not already subscribed to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. I'm trying to hit 50k by the end of the year. So that'd be amazing. But let's get into the lineup. Uh, there are a couple changes that I made to the team. Adding some chemistries in, uh, moving some chemistries around with some players, and what I plan to do with the squad. Now, if you guys haven't seen my max mutt level video, make sure you guys check that video out. But... Of course, starting off at running back, we do have 95 Ricky Williams now because we just hit max mutt level. And you can see him compared to Zeke and Saquon. Uh, obviously, he helped a lot when it came to winning these games. 91 speed, 91 excel, 90 agility, 95 carrying with a 70 catch, 94 looseness, 89 trucking with a 92 break tackle. Now, I don't plan on making any sort of upgrades right now over the next couple of days because obviously we have Friday. Which a lot of people think is going to be most feared and what I predict is going to be the most feared as well. And I'm almost positive it will be most feared. So, I'm not going to make any more changes to the team for now. But Ricky Williams is definitely a stud. Now wide receiver, we did just get the new Steve Smith. I'm really thinking about getting Steve Smith on the squad. Uh, maybe replacing Tyreek Hill with him or just moving Tyreek down to uh, wide receiver 4. I guess I could do that and just keep him still at kick returner, punt returner. And then put in uh, Steve Smith here. Fullback, I don't care. Don McNabb, we do have... Uh, limited time or not limited time we have a uh, power of Dunham McNabb and limited time Drew Brees so I do have a giveaway going on on Twitter right now for limited Drew Brees if you guys haven't seen that video make sure you guys check it out someone will be winning that Brees on Xbox or PlayStation doesn't matter which console or which console uh, we also have Jerry Rice team captain Greg Olson Lane Johnson Larry Allen Travis Frederick Steve Hudson and Jonathan Ogden for the offensive line now to the defense side we did make a couple of changes over here as well uh I think chemistry-wise, we did change... Who was it that I changed for chem? I know someone did get a chemistry change, but my newest pickup is actually Bobby Wagner. So we ended up picking up Mutt Heroes Bobby Wagner on the defensive side, and I gotta say, he has been huge uh, in this journey. Comparing him to Deion Jones, which is who I upgraded from, he's made a big difference in the game, and he's had a couple times where he'll like swat a pass or something, and then he'll die for it and catch it. And the fact that he is unfakeable, I've seen it a lot and it definitely is helped plus the block shed 87 from 72 is one of the major reasons i picked him up to help in the run game 92 hip power compared to 85 uh, i think he did cause a couple fumbles the tackling of course is way better so i didn't put secure tackler on him that's why i put a fake one on him uh the play rank is 95 zone is the same as Dion jones it's just that he has the chemistry on him and it's not going to show the chem on Dion right now I actually think he has one less zone. 72 strength and 87 acceleration, 86 speed, because, of course, I do have the John Madden with the zone coverage. Plus, lockdown fully maxed out, so I'm pretty sure Dion actually has one more zone than Bobby Wagner. But Wagner's just been a killer on this team. 79 catching as well, and a jumping of an 89 from an 80. But this is the rest of the team, and, of course, we do have the Most Feared promo coming out very soon, which I'm predicting we're going to get a Most Feared Khalil Mack. So if we do get a Khalil Mack, I believe he'll be a left end. Uh, he does play outside linebacker for the Bears, but I know that his card in the game is a left end, so hopefully they keep him left end because I have Reggie White here, and I want to get rid of Reggie and pick a Mack attack because that would be disgustingly good uh, from out of defense. We also have Jadavion Clowney, Damon Harrison, who I might uh, switch out for want short from the mud hero edition we do have the basically on my team and by the way i don't need defensive tackle number two because of course i'm going to three four david's tackle two that barely ever comes in uh cornerbacks i think we're pretty stacked there and the rest of the squad offensively though i kind of want to pick up steve smith and we're going to wait till most to see who comes out and then if we get a team of the week deck that's all i'm gonna say about that but i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you did smack the like button subscribe and comment let me know down below how you guys did in your weekend league i actually didn't have time to play solo battles this week so <laughs> not gonna have any solo battle rewards sadly but we do hopefully uh well you know hopefully we'll end up finishing in top 100 for weekend league if not still get ultimate which i'm not gonna be mad at at all we get 110,000 coins plus some serious trophies which then i'll be able to do an 80 i think it's 89 to 91 overall pack maybe it's 80 to 90, i think it's 80 to 90 uh overall pack for you guys and i'll try to save a couple of those maybe get like two three of them before i make a video so we can have a much bigger video and hopefully get some really good pulls but I hope you guys enjoyed the video smack the like button subscribe and comment i will see you guys next time